What is one of your proudest moments? For me, being there when my mom passed away was a proud moment. I had helped my mom to record audio of her life philosophy as a life coach and a spiritual guide for people earlier that summer. I had helped her prepare the paperwork for power of attorney and her will. I had helped her with her medicine to go on hospice. And really what I'm most proud of about that time was just being there, just showing up with my sister and holding her hand that morning as she had passed and just being there. For me, that's what, that's what a spiritual guide, a daughter, <laughs> and a good friend does for someone. It's just be there. What questions are you passionate about asking in seminary? How can faith help us come together across difference? We live in such a divided and diverse world and there is so much hardship. I've worked for climate justice and racial justice throughout my career. And I know that people profoundly disagree. I also know that we don't need everyone in order to change the world. We need a critical mass of people to put aside their differences and come together. So how can faith bring people together who perhaps are turned off by Christianity or by religion in general, or bring people together who believe differently or practice different faiths. I also want to ask a personal question. How can I, as a spiritual guide, hold people in their grief, loss, and change while also still holding my heart well? How do other people of faith do that? Why am I a good candidate for the Sacred Worth Fellowship? I've dedicated my life to social change. I'm a transgender mom, activist, and woman of faith. I remember when I came out as transgender, my cousin Mark sent me an email about how I was living in sin and I needed to remember how God made me. I remember how upset I was. I talked to my pastor, to my friends, and I did research and what I learned is that Mark was acting like so many others out of his belief with uncertain judgment. And Jesus really taught us not to do that, <laughs> to not act with judgment towards others and really to seek understanding from those who differ from us with a humble heart. My life is about fighting for people to live their dreams in safety, dignity, and respect. Thank you.